My name is Brandon Hartung, and I am a media missionary. I travel all over the world working with missionaries, using photography and video to tell the story of impact those ministries are having, and to inspire people to make a difference by getting involved with those ministries. Brandon came to Iraq a few months ago. Malawi, Africa. Came to Belize. Come down to Colombia. Tokyo, Japan. I was in San Pedro Sula, Honduras. I feel like media was such a big need for our ministry. We really didn't have anyone telling the stories of the ministry, um, telling our stories as missionaries, and we really didn't have the skill set um, to do this for ourselves. No less than three times a week, I will get a request from a church asking me just for a quick video or something that they would like to be able to see what's going on. When we go into the churches, sometimes they only give us three minutes or they only give us five minutes, but yet it was like capturing it in a nutshell so we could use that as a tool when we're presenting our vision to supporters or churches. And that was a huge blessing. Brandon had not come, I may have missed out on a lot of support acts. Not only the churches, that want to see a video, something live, something you know, moving, not just a still picture, but also using social media, I was able to put it up anywhere. Because of his expertise, he was able to move around freely. I didn't have to instruct him. He was able to take pictures, getting up on rooftops, getting it behind the altar during the services, the kids worshiping, um, some really great video. He just pulled it all together. He took things that we had no idea how he was going to make that work. And he took pictures, videos that were like, I don't know what that's going to do for us. And in the end, just made beautiful masterpieces out of it. It's just been phenomenal, the reception that we've had from his efforts and from the work and that he's done over here for us. And it's just been a true blessing to our ministry and to our personal life. Anyone that comes to the service at our soup kitchen knows that it's hot. He sweated like the rest of us and, and, and offered to come back again and again. And, uh, he's not just the person that comes to the service beside you, but he becomes a part of your ministry and becomes a friend because he really has the heart for missions. This is not something, he's just not doing this as a job or as a way to have an adventure. This is a passion of his and he loves missions. The media that Brandon is able to provide is a lifeblood to all of our ministries. So without what he's doing, we can't tell our stories. Without me telling our stories, um, people can't be involved with what they don't know about. Brandon is so great to work with, and I really would love it if people can support what he does because he is a missionary and he's doing it sacrificially. This is a dedicated person and he is there doing this for the sake of the gospel. So anyone that can give support for Brandon supports missionaries around the world really because he's there to help the missionary.